A sitemap is a list of all the pages on your website. Googlebot uses a sitemap to crawl and index your website, allowing it to better understand your pages, find out how your pages are related, and display the results properly in search engine results. By submitting your sitemap to the Google Search Console, you can easily view your website's indexing status in the Webmaster Tools and get more insights on how your search engine ranking is progressing. Hi guys, this is Shaswin Valia from Team Learn Today. And in this SOP, we will submit our XML sitemap, which we generated by Yoast SEO in the previous SOP to the Google Search Console. So without further ado, let's get into the video. The first step to getting your XML sitemap submitted into the Google Search Console and getting it indexed is actually going to Google Search Console. So what you're gonna do is go to Google and search for Google Search Console. There you go, this is the first thing that is going to pop up and you just have to click on that. Start now. You have to put your domain over here. So just put your domain for me, it would be justinvalia.com and continue. Awesome, now you just need to get it verified, sign into your domain name provider, which is Hostinger, GoDaddy, Namecheap, whatever it is, copy this text record into the DNS configuration and you will have it verified. So I'll quickly do this step. All right, so once you have logged into your DNS provider dashboard, for me, it's host enjoy, yours could be GoDaddy or anything else. You just have to log in to your service provider. And once you do that, let me just open up my hostings. And from here, I can just go to justvenvalia.com and manage. All right, now we have to paste the TXT record. Okay, so once you're in your hosting account, whatever, wherever you're hosting your website, so basically if you have gotten your domain from another website and you're hosting from another website, then you have to choose the one where you got your hosting from. For example, I chose name.com to get my domain, but I hosted my website on Hostinger. So I have to come to Hostinger and get the Google verification from here. So let's go ahead, scroll down a little bit. All right, and you will land on advanced. From here, what we have to do is we have to get into DNS zone editor. So choose txt from here, keep name blank and paste the Google verification code that you have got in the txt value. Do not change the TTL over here and just add the record. Now it might take a little bit time to get it verified. It might take four to six hours or it might just be verified the next day. But let's just proceed to the next step. All right, now that we've come here and we have verified or we have copied and pasted the code, we just have to verify it from here. It's gonna check your verification and ownership verification has been failed. It will take a little bit of time. So you just need to have patience. All right, so it has been a few hours since I last went up and verified my domain name and as you can see the ownership is now verified so let's just move ahead and complete the rest of the steps you just go to go to property from here and as you can see they would welcome you saying welcome to your new domain property just need to hit on start and as you can see there are a lot of um, helping boxes, help boxes right here, which you can definitely read up. I'm just gonna click on this. And in the left sidebar right here, you can see under index, you will find sitemaps. So you will have to click on sitemaps from here and they will tell you what you need to do. So you just need to click on start. 
see sitemaps that Google has found on your site and submit new ones. So what you need to do next is just go back to the XML sitemap that we generated in the last SOP. Go right here and copy this. Go back to the Google Search Console and put the whole thing here and then just submit it. It takes a little time, submit. Sometimes it takes some time for it to get indexed as well. Sitemap submitted successfully. Google will periodically process it and look for changes. You will be notified if anything goes wrong with it in the future. And as you can see, the status is success and our sitemap has been indexed successfully. Hope you guys were able to submit your sitemap successfully as well. If you have any questions, any queries or any other videos that you would like to see on the Learn Today channel, feel free to put them in the comment section down below. Go ahead and hit on that like button, subscribe button along with the notification bell icon so that you can get updates on whenever we come up with new videos. This is Jaswan Walia and I will see you in our next SOP.